Welcome Epic Gamers! I am on a quest to find the best possible playstyle in Modern Warfare 3. The gunsmith allows for an infinite amount of creative freedom and will be the key to craft a vast variety of weapon builds shooting all playstyles you can dream of. The goal? To get in the mindset of other players and to showcase all the playstyles we run into in Call of Duty. This is Call of Duty Playstyles. Oh, work was so ass today. I'm just so happy to be home and just play some Call of Duty with you. Yeah, I feel you, bro. We don't get a lot of time to play now that we work 9 to 5 jobs. Nah, we don't. But at least we're here now. And considering how well we both played last game, we're having a good time right now. <laughs> yeah, this game is so casual, I love it. I don't get why everyone's complaining about skill-based matchmaking. It doesn't exist, obviously. Wait, what? what's that knocking? It's probably just little Timmy I'm hearing. He's just waiting to go 0-20 this game. <laughs> The Sweat is the most dangerous opponent to come across in Modern Warfare 3. With their unstoppable aim and use of meta weapons, these movement guards are a force to be reckoned with. So after searching non-stop for a class for like a week straight, I ended up settling with this one. We're gonna be running the Striker 9 submachine gun. Has a fast fire rate, pretty low damage, but if you're accurate with it, you should be able to kill the opponents pretty quickly. So without further ado, let's hop straight into the game. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is time. Let's take some kills. Oh my goodness, they're loud. It is a time for our first game. I'm excited to see how this is gonna go. This guy fucking whispered me and asked if I was unemployed. Wait, I want to check what what did he actually say? It's some serious free time. Okay. <laughs> That's funny. Dude, that's crazy. I have just been playing zombies. So as the sweat, we have to remember we got a slide cancel, why, why, jump, and shake our screen as much as possible when we're doing this. We gotta be really trying to imitate how this species operates. Also, I never play like this, so it's gonna be an experiment for all of us. Which is kind of the whole point of this series too. To put ourselves in the mindset of other players and see how they operate. Alright, so I gotta gotta think about like I gotta why why I gotta shake, I gotta do all this stuff. Cause I'm I'm not used to it. I'm really not used to it. Alright, we go up the ladder, we jump, I see there's a guy over here, slide away from the danger, got him. Easy kill. We hit him with a slide jump. Alright, we got one kill. You guys ready? There's gonna be more here. There we go. Doing pretty good right now. I gotta say, so far, I'm not the biggest fan of this weapon. I also only have it level 3, so I don't have the attachments I need for it. I definitely feel like 30 bullets is too little. Easy kill. Easiest kill of my life. Pooped on. Ah, uh, they spawned there. Alright, this guy's just camping up top, that's cool. That's cool, we'll cover you in another playstyle video. Yes, triple kill. This guy spawned right in front of me, okay cool, cool, nice game. Ooh, pooped on, pooped on. Break his ankles. We broke his ankles. Hey, let's go. We got the W. Alright, I'll definitely say first kind of impression I'm getting. It's pretty difficult to manually think about that you have to sweat. Like in the sense that I'm constantly thinking about that I have to jump, slide, YY and shake my screen. It's very hard to like get into the habit of doing those things when you're not used to it. I feel like whenever I jump, it's pretty situational. I don't just do it just to do it. You know, like sometimes you get shot by someone in Call of Duty and he jumps like five times before he even kills you. Or the people that shoot you in the back and yet they like slide jump slide on you or something even though you're not even fucking looking in their direction. Stuff like that. That's what I'm trying to replicate but it's pretty hard like when it's not in your mind because it's not something I'm used to. I, I think I'm going to the meet 24 7 playlist because when I can use the striker in there it's gonna be a little more close ranged. Alright, we're gonna meet. 24-7 play this time. 
Dude, what the fuck did I join into, man? I just hear VTOL. Yep, no, we're not playing this. That game didn't count. This is the real deal. We got meat, we got hard point. It's go time. All right, let's get this bread. There we go, we got the first blood. Number two. We're hitting with a slide. Kill the FK people. Split quad feed. Another one. Damn. When you play the meat 24-7 players, there's just a lot of shotguns. That's just how it is. Pooped on. I hit him with that movement. We slide through. Ah. Uh. Pooped on. Pooped on. Oh, that was so close. Yeah, one thing that's really annoying is I run out of bullets a lot when I use this. Easy kill on the shotgunner. Pooped on, pooped on. Maybe the pistol's just better than the submachine gun. Easy. Oh my god, I'm so good. Pooped on. Alright, everyone's just using a shotgun, bro. Me 24-7 in a nutshell, huh? Oof! That was quite nice. Oof. Oof. Gotta pick up the sniper. Ah, bro, it's this fucking virgin guy to. all the time. Yeah, sit down, bitch. All right. Well, I feel like I've gotten into the Swiss mindset a little bit more during this game. One thing that's very difficult is if you have the wrong weapon for the wrong situation. So like, if I'm playing this map and I'm close range and I'm running around, even though I have an SMG, if you run into a shotgun, boom, you did. If I run into a sniper long distance or an AR at long distance fights, boom, I'm dead. <laughs> this guy texted me after the game. Try playing the OBJ, your bud. <laughs> hmm. What What would a sweat say? I think the average sweat would say something like, Get better, bud. Skill issue. Your movement is... Terrible. Mr. Laymore on the ground. Nice. <gasps> Guys, we did it! Imagine sweating that hard just to lose your butts. Dude, we fucking did it, man. If someone's calling me sweaty, it means we lived up to the name. Let's go. I have never been so proud to be called a sweat in my life. Feeling so tall, I like could give a high five to the pilot. Yeah, family tight, I keep small circle like island.